everyone, this is Gleesa made with the Glee. Now I've been showing you guys I was working on this for Christmas in July. I have two of them completely finished and I finished them according to the instructions in the package. Now basically what you have to do is cut to one square within the design pretty much all the way around. I don't know if you guys can see that, can you see? And then on the back, yes this is how my back looks. Here, there is a wire that they give you. Um, you cut it in four equal pieces and you're supposed to bend it. They give you a little template to bend and you attach it here with some couching stitches in the back of your work. And this is what they call finished. Now, this is great, this is cute, but I don't like my back showing and I would like a more finished look on my ornament. Um, again, this is the kit. It's by Dimensions, called Christmas Jar Ornaments, and as you can see, that's exactly how they did it. So, this is done, but I'm not going to do that. What I'm going to do is I want to cover the back of my stitching with a piece of felt. And yes, I will use glue on the back of my stitching. I don't mind that, because I want these things to last forever. <laughs> a really, really long time. I have two done. I'll probably pass, you know, one each to my kids when they get their houses or whatever. So what I'm doing, this is a piece of felt, but it's a little stiffer than the normal felt. And I'm going to take a pencil and I'm just going to draw right around. Oops. Did I just draw on top of my thing? I don't know. So <laughs> I'm going to draw around and um, I'm going to cut the piece of felt and then glue it and trim it onto my the back of my ornament. So I'm just trying to get a little rough outline of how it is right now. And then once I go ahead and I trim that, as you can see that's a jar, I'm going to cut that out and glue it on the back to call it finish. But that is how I'm going to finish it. So here's the first one, here's the second one, and... I love it, it's really cute, but like I said, I'm going to try to, to make it a little bit better. So I'm going to do that, and I'll get back to you after I cut out my piece.